Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play uh, Metroid Zero Mission. Forgot the name for a moment. So yes, um, I'm not playing with a GameCube controller right now. I'm playing with a Game Boy Advance SP hooked up to the GameCube. This feels a lot better, a lot better, but the cord that hooks it up to the GameCube, I don't know, it's feeling kind of awkward, especially since that's so close to the R button. Ugh. But all right, yeah, hopefully this will do. I'm also playing with like the volume completely off my SP and uh, the backlight off because this thing does not really hold a charge anymore. Oh, dear God. Yeah, this feels kind of awkward in my hand. Like, if I'm being completely honest, I'd rather be playing with my fat uh, DS right now. Oh my god, these, these L and R buttons. No, this is not gonna work out. Maybe I'll give it a shot with my uh, fat Game Boy Advance as well. I don't know, we'll, we'll see if it ever has to come down to that. Oh, okay. Uh, there still seems to be a little input lag. Uh, Alright, well, no, I guess I'm just being paranoid. Okay, just murder everything. And it was just for missiles! I came here for no... I knew it! I knew it! Even in the previous part, I'm thinking, I was like, uh, but I think there's only missiles there, so I might be wasting my time. Eh. I wasn't gonna shine spark there anyway. There'd have been nowhere for me to go. All right, so. Yeah, we just wanna go back down that path. Well, since we have the various suit now, we can, you know, explore the super heated areas. So yeah, I guess that's where we initially wanted to go. But I freaking knew it. I freaking knew there would be just only missiles there. I even said it too. Yeah, it would have been best if I had got that like way back when I had just, you know, got the bombs. It was easy enough to bomb jump my way up there. All right. Eh. I was just gonna breeze through this room, but fine, we'll play normal. Yeah, this controls a lot better, but, ugh. Just have to hold my hand awkwardly. Yeah, the Game Boy Advance SP, this was designed for little kids. Or at least people with smaller hands, oh my god. My hand I'm just holding my hands at an awkward way. I know I can make that jump, damn it. Okay, you know what? Oh, really? I can't make that? Make no, I wanted to freeze him and then use him as a stepping stone. Or I could just do this, you know. Do the smart thing. Miss my target. Okay, come on. Nope. There we go. I'm tired of this area being gray and that missile tank mocking me. I think it's just easier to wait until you have the space jump to even like go for that. Wait, is there something else I'm missing up here? Cause there's another little gray area or is that just mocking me as well? Yeah, it's just mocking me. Oh, right. Well, what do we have up there? The superheated area, fine. We'll go for it, since it's right here. These enemies, so annoying to deal with. Aha, I ain't afraid of no heat. Oh God, I'm afraid of you though. Oh, you're kind of weak. Oh no. Boiling lava. No. High jump. I'm jumping too high. Oh my god. Alright. All that for missiles. You will not trick me, Rune. I thought there's a. Okay. Apparently not. 
that looks like where they would hide like a little fake wall for you to, you know, bomb your way through or missile your way through, but no, just bombing the wall showed me nothing, so there was nothing there. Oh my god. There's a quicker way to get down there, isn't there? I, I believe if I go over here, there's gonna be something Hold on, I remember there being something over here, like a little shortcut to go all the way to the bottom. I'm not crazy. Uh, but then I'd have to make that whole loop. Fine, we'll just go down like normal. Wait, but no, that's that can be destroyed. Right. Something's amiss here. Okay, yeah, I'm probably just remembering wrong then. Or maybe it was all the way up at the top. Yeah, like I said, I'm not about to make that loop again, so we're just gonna do this normally. Alright, so down here, we're gonna have to do another one. Or am I just gonna have to... Well, I'll have super missiles to blast through that door at the very end. It is super missiles, right? Screw you! Yep, super missiles. Okay! And down here. So, yep, right there. Okay. I remember this room. I remember these guys. I... I'm playing kind of stupidly right now. Okay, okay, yeah, I'm about to die, so, uh... Yeah, I need to stop playing lazily and stupidly. Like, this is mostly just laziness, though. Like, I'm just not even paying attention to the enemies. But again, that's what a good speed runner does, you know, just not pay attention to the enemies. They just pay attention to the task at hand. All right, so new territory. Crap, oh well, I can make this jump. I can't, all right, well then. Looks, is it up here? No, oh, it's right there, okay. All right, now I can make that jump, all right, cool. And then all of this is just, you know, we need to destroy all this so we can have like a good, oh no, fireflies! That's what I'm calling them. I'm sticking to it. Are they all dead? Still a few more. I just want to kill them so we can have an easier time with this room. Yeah, you just want to destroy everything because we're going to be running. All right. Yeah, we're gonna be running through here. Through speed boost blocks. All right, here we go. There we go, there we go. Yeah, yeah, it feels a lot better. Oh no. Yeah, this feels a lot better than the GameCube controller. Like, really. Like, I'm still not at my full comfortability, but uh, hey, it's something. Comfortability, that doesn't seem like a real word, but it is now. I just coined it. Take that to the banks. So I can continue on this way. What? What's on this way? I believe this is a... Okay. Uh, I can't remember like what's a dead end and what leads me to stuff. I did not mean to go through that door. Okay, well then, that's a super missile. Whatever, we'll just go through here. Getting killed by everything. So then, 
It was just a roundabout way to get here? This is pointless. Unless, damn it. Unless there's, uh, something I'm missing in here, like a power up or health. No, no E tanks, no missile tanks. This is like a pointless little path, really. Okay, what, whatever. Just running into everything. I don't give a damn anymore. Map room, you're kind of useless now. Oh. Okay, well, not that useless. Yep, that's the North Fair map. And this is fake lava, in case you couldn't tell. You know, because that enemy was going through it. Okay. Got some turbo turtles there. And I believe that is fake lava as well. No, this is real lava. This is real lava. Th that is real lava. But there's stuff down there. Um, but yeah, we can't do anything with that just yet. I do not like this room! Oh man. Why did I duck? Uh, I remember this place oh so well. I'm gonna wait for you. Okay, I'm not even doing uh, my little spin jumps. I'm gonna make sure I don't fall down there. Okay. There's something up here. Uh... Or maybe not. This looks like where there would be something. Oh, so is there a... Oh man, I'm just running around lost and confused. Whatever, let's just go ahead and get what's going to be right here. Still got a little ways to go. Damn it. Oh, really? That... Okay, well, I'm just going to have to wait for him to unthaw. Alright, I can make that. Yeah, I knew something was going to jump out. Oh boy, missiles! <laughs> Again! Oh, pointless sidetrack for missiles. Ah, uh, whatever. Oh my god. Jumping into lava like a dumb... Okay. I'm just gonna wait for them to move out of the way. I'm not even gonna worry about freezing them. Oh my god. Get out of the lava! Okay, come on, do your thing. Wow, I thought I was gonna get hurt there. Wait. I'm missing! <sighs> Only because there, there's something there. I'm thinking missile, but hell, it could end up being a uh, E tank, really. Wait a minute. Ah! Okay, yeah, it's missiles. Alright. I was kind of hoping E tank, but hey, I'll, I'll take what I can get. All right, so now let's really leave this place. I'm tired of this room. Okay. There we go. So is there gonna be one of those little cannons right here? Oh, what the hell? Oh, huh, that's confusing, but all right, whatever. Let's leave this place finally and go over here. Yeah, I'm not gonna be dealing with this shit. Oh crap, no, 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 no. Get into my line of fire, thank you. And yeah, we just got a lot of vines right here. I guess this is a callback to, uh, nope. Uh, Metroid Fusion. One of the bosses there have vines all over the place. And this will be fake lava. Haha. -ha. 
I knew I'd be right eventually. Crap! Oh well, whatever, he died. Probably should have took like a little more strategy with that, but hey, whatever, I'm about to heal right here. And we have the wave beam. We can now shoot through shit. I think the game's gonna put it in better terms than I could. This beam, which is made up of energy waves, can pass through solid objects. So, yeah, we, we can shoot through stuff now, I mean, yeah. It's useful. Well, of course it's useful, I mean, it's also freaking overpowered, too. Anything? No, okay. Well, yeah, now, uh, this asshole is back, but now with the power of the wave beam, He's dead. It probably would have been quicker to just bomb the wall and use missiles, but hey, I have the wave beam now. I'm going to exploit it. Ah, the wave beam is so great. I like the wave beam. So now we can go over here. Awkward little save room. Don't know why the terrain was changed a little, but whatever. All right, come on, let's kill them things. Now, plus with the wave beam, we got more range too. That's always good. That's a speed boost. Oh, wow, okay, looks like I'm just gonna be running and gunning. All right. So yeah, we're through there. Let's keep it going. Oh, I can't. So yeah, now we can effectively deal with these guys. We're just gonna go ahead and shoot your belly. You are dead. I want those goodies. Thank you. Well, no! I do not like you. Yeah, you're easy enough to deal with. I shoot you back. And then I just lay a lot of bombs. And some of them will eventually hit you. Not all of them, just, just some of them, just some of them. I really thought we'd be on our way to Ridley's lair, actually. Or maybe that's gonna be after this, once I go down a little more. I want to get to Ridley's lair in this session. Oh, there we go, okay. Right when I was finally beginning to remember the... Okay, there's an E-Tank right there. But yeah, right when I was finally beginning to remember his, like, the best way to deal with him. Come on! Or is that a missile? It was a missile. All right, never mind. Energy tank acquired. So, no, I, screw you. Uh, yeah, okay. So now that he's dead, we're just gonna go back in here and then continue our little speed boost. And grab this missile. All right, we're really rolling in the missiles now. I believe this is just a pointless little Side area. Yeah, what is the point of that lone missile block there? That's just... That was stupid. It's like, you can use... Like, go that way if you want to deliberately avoid getting the missile tank. Well, I guess that's good for a... You know, low percentage run, but... I don't know, considering it's easy to avoid that on its own, I mean... Whatever. Okay, come on, let's just destroy all these vines. Some need missiles, some can just, you know, take regular shots. This room is actually rather creepy. All right, so the door closed behind us. It's a big arena. That can only mean one thing. Boss time. Ooh, I do not like this boss. Yeah, okay. So what you wanna do is freeze this thing. Oh my God, you thaw quickly. Okay. Crap. Is there something I can grab onto? Oh, wait a minute. No, there's, there's a better way than this. There's a better way. Okay, come on. I just wanna be on the edge. 
Come on. Ugh. This doesn't seem to be working. I remember this working in the past, but... Screw it. I think I'm just going to go back to what they want me to do. Freeze him. Oh my god. How would I deal with you in the past? There has to be, like, a simpler way that I've forgotten. Oh, this seems to be working. Yeah, this isn't hard at all. It's just annoying. Okay, so whatever. Time consuming too. Like, oh my god. Oh, of course. Oh, so all the tendrils are done on that side, so... Oh my god. Seriously? No. Okay, yep, so it's all done on that side, so... Just have, like, one more to go on this side. Yep, alright, that's it. And it falls down. And we're not going to have to worry about it. That could have gone a lot faster. I forgot how to effectively fight that thing. I knew I had... I, I remember I had a way to, like, do it real quickly. I think it might have been a mix of, like, just standing on the very edge and just, like, jumping up. Whatever, retreat to a little cutscene here. Ridley takes flight. And here we are at Ridley! Ridley's lair. I don't know, I'd like to call it, you know, uh, Lower Norfair or Norfair's, Norfair's Depths. Whatever, um... You know what, screw it. Let, let, let's do uh, one more little thing here. Might as well get out the way and then next time we can devote, like, the entirety of that episode to getting down to where we're gonna fight Ridley. Yeah, spoilers, but come on, you, you already know we're going to fight Ridley. It's, it's a Metroid game. Yep, that was that little thing, that cocoon, husk, whatever we fought. It burrowed down into the ground. That, I wonder if that's going to be important, if I can get up here. I think I might have taken a wrong turn somewhere. Unless... Okay, wait a minute. No. Something's amiss. Something is not right here. There's nothing we can do in here. Did I have to activate some? Oh no, wait a minute, I forgot, okay. So yeah, like when you go down here, you're supposed to think like, but there's nothing I can do. Like there's, there's nowhere for me to go. So then, uh, you know, remember how I brought up how that thing burrowed down? Yeah. It works really fast. So yeah, here we are back at Ridley and, oh no, it's gone. Wherever could it have gone? right here so yeah let's destroy these eggs and then all right so my strategy with this just hold both L and R and shoot missiles wildly I'm actually rather low on missiles but yeah when it's going this way you can just you know run straight you don't have to aim come on turn around Okay, really? Come on, you B. I believe its official name is Imago or something. That's a weird name. 
Yeah, I am running really low on missiles, so let's just get you to go back this way so I don't miss. Yeah, <laughs> so I don't miss with my missiles. Okay, and yes, its little stinger fell down. It's actually quite disgusting, really. And then... I don't know if you can take damage from that, but I'm not taking any chances. Alright, and then we get our first super missile tank. Arm with select, fire with R plus B, opens green hatches. Pretty much, you know, it's just a more powerful regular missile. They're really good to have. All right, so now let's get out of here. Kill them for hopefully, you know, health. Yeah, okay, and thank you. All right. And showing the super missiles in action. Yeah. So uh, we'll be exploring uh, down this little path next time. Ooh, it's beginning to come back to me just like how insane this place is in terms of like hidden missile tanks and uh, energy tanks and stuff. Like there's even going to be some like insane shine sparking we're going to have to do. I hope I'm ready for it. I hope I'm ready. But yep, next time hopefully we'll uh, find some more stuff here and get down to uh, where we're going to fight Ridley. As you can sort of tell by that little box to the lower left. You know, that's, that's where we're going to fight him. Spoiler alert, but then again it's not really a spoiler when he shows up in, you know, 90% of the games. But yep, all that and more next time. So thank you all for watching and see you next time for some more Let's Play Metroid Zero Mission with a better handle on the controls now that I switched to a Game Boy Advance. But all right, goodbye.